Hi. Welcome back to the Times News. Crimea bridge closed after fuel depot hit Russia. Russian authorities have said a drone attack on an ammunition depot in Crimea has led to civilian evacuations and disrupted transport. Sergei Aksyonov, the Russian-installed governor of occupied Crimea, said Ukraine was behind the attack without providing evidence. Mr. Aksyonov said local residents living within five kilometers of the blast were being evacuated. Rail services across the Kerch Bridge have also reportedly been halted. Earlier on Saturday, Russian authorities stopped traffic on the bridge, but then swiftly reopened it to cars. A later update from the Moscow-installed government said, road traffic was again halted, until further notice. The district where the strike was reported is more than 160 kilometers from the Kerch Bridge. The bridge, often referred to as the Crimea Bridge, was opened in 2018 enabling road and rail access between Russia and Crimea, Ukrainian territory annexed by Moscow in 2014. It has become a symbol of Russian occupation and is also an important resupply route for Russian forces in southern Ukraine. On Monday, a blast on the bridge killed two people and damaged the road, but the railway line, which runs parallel to it, was not damaged. The Kremlin blamed Kiev for Monday's attack and said Ukraine had carried out a terrorist act. Russian President Vladimir Putin vowed to retaliate and accused Ukraine of launching a senseless and cruel attack. Ukrainian President Volodymyr Zelensky has said, the Crimea Bridge is a legitimate target. Speaking on Friday, he spoke of the need to neutralize the bridge, explaining it was the route used to feed the war with ammunition, and this is being done on a daily basis, and that Kiev sees it as an enemy facility. Mr. Zelensky said, so understandably, this is a target for us. Monday's alleged attack was the second major incident on the Kerch Bridge in the past year. In October 2022, the bridge was partially closed following a huge explosion. It was fully reopened in February. So these are all the latest developments so far that I presented to you. If you like this news, so please like, share, and subscribe. See you in the next time. Goodbye.